Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this little video is going to be about line end caps and how you can change them a little bit. We're going to change both of these lines to like a thicker line. But what if we want round end caps on this one, and that's the normal that you would do. Just double click on your pen tool and go to round end caps, and then you have round end caps. But the round end caps are perfect for some reason let's say you don't want them perfect well if you will click on rounded corners you get a ball up here let me move this out of the way maybe we could you know what if i let me cancel that out let me um, zoom in on this now we're going to go to so you have to see the square up here and you have to go to round corners let me move this out of the way and then you can angle this thing to get a different shape. If you ever, I don't know why you would, but you might want to have a different, a little bit less than perfect, you know, end cap. You know, if you do them sideways, you're going to get the whole line. And if you look at it, if we convert that to an object, you can really tell the difference by left clicking and right clicking. Another pretty neat thing about this is if you use the pen tool and double click on it, you can rotate. You don't have to do anything about the corners. This is square. Let's go ahead and make them round, uh, round, but then let's angle it. And look what it's doing to the whole thing. It's making some of the lines thicker and thinner. And then we're going to go OK. We'll grab the item. We'll go to object, convert it to an outline, and look at the difference. So now you have a symmetrical variation of thick and thin lines. Pretty cool. Hope that helped just a little bit. Thank you for watching.